back to another client tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how I created this really nice full glam quick and easy matte look. So if you're interested then please keep on watching. So first I'm going to be going in with my all time favourite Makeup Revolution Pro Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Chocolate. And I'm going to be defining the eyebrows with this with my Morphe Angle brush. And I always start kind of further to the outer edge of the brow to make sure I get that kind of faded effect. Now I'm going in with the Nip and Fab Concealer in the shade 10 and shout out to KJ for this part and I'm going to be defining underneath the eyebrow. Then once that's all sharpened up, I'm going in with a fluffier brush and just coating this all over the lid. Now I'm going in with the P. Louise Makeup Academy Secret Center Palette and I'm going in with the shade Fling and just popping this in the crease of the eye. And I'm using this as my transition colour. And then to deepen those edges, I'm going in with the shade Love Struck. And next, I'm going in with my Jewy highlighter in the shade Rose Quartz, and I'm popping this on the inner corner of the eye. So that's me completely finished the top lid, it was just really quick and easy. And then to darken underneath, I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Gel Liner in the shade Noir Black, and I'm popping this in the waterline. And then I'm just going to buff it out with the colours that we used on top. What goes up must come down as they all say. I'm just going to prep the skin with a nice moisturising serum first. And then I'm going in with the next shine colour and prepping the more oily areas. And then I'm going to pop on one of my favourites. These are the Prima Lashes in the style Savage. I love these. They're not so nice and fluffy. And then for foundation, I'm using MAC Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC35 and putting this all over the face. And I'm using a Real Techniques stippling brush to do this. For concealer, I'm using the Collection 2000 concealer and popping this under the eyes and in the T-zone area.
And then for powder, I'm using the MAC Press Mineralized Skin Finish Powder and then popping this in the T zone. And to contour, I'm using this lovely grey undertone bronzer by MAC and I'm just putting this in the hollows of the cheek. And then to further more bronze that out, I'm using the Bronze and Jewel by Ella Masca in the shade Glint and Ra. For blusher, I'm using the shade Spring Sheen by MAC. And then for highlighter, I'm using the shade OMG by Ella Masca. This is an OG favourite, it's absolutely beautiful. And then I just went back in with a bit more eyeshadow just to make sure the concealer hadn't taken any of that kind of smokiness away. And then I'm just adding a little bit of mascara to finish off the eyes. For lip liner I'm using Spice by MAC and just overlining the lips slightly. And then for lipstick I'm using the Makeup Revolution Pro lipstick and I'm sure the shade is heroin I'm using and it's a lovely pink nude. And then just add in a little bit of gloss to finish it off. So that is the finished look, I hope you all love it. Thanks again for all the support on all these videos, I really appreciate it. And I hope you're all enjoying them and if you have any recommendations for any further more tutorials then just let me know. Thank you!